Hello folk. 2016 is turning out to be a significant year for Shirley Boys High School and Avonside Girls High School. I think most of us who understand what life has been like in Christchurch post-earthquake um, would understand the term, if I used it, which goes along the, the lines of to get anything done is akin to wading through molasses. And we've done that for a significant number of years. But in 2016, we're finally starting to see significant progress. What have we achieved so far? The Ministry, Avonside Girls, Shirley Boys and the City Council all talking to each other. Every single one of those groups with the intent of getting us um, as soon as possible into the old QE2 site. For us, that means that we now have a goal to aim for. And you could well be saying to us, all right, what is contained within that general goal? And so for us, here's where we are. The first thing is that we will be with adjacent to the Eastern Sport and Rec Centre. And for us, that means we will be part of a very significant resource for all the people living in the East. Secondly, as we're built, our facilities are going to be available for people in the East. And if you think about that, what does that mean for all of us? It means that Shirley and Avonside will be very much a part of the community that is the eastern part of Christchurch, what I happily call the seaside side, side of Christchurch. What else is going to happen? If you can imagine a spine down the middle with a performing arts centre and a hall and the type, the type of resources that are going to be useful and available for the people of, um, of the East. And then on one side, if you can imagine Avonside Girls and the other side, Shirley Boys, that will tell you very clearly that our schools will remain as single sex separate schools, sharing in a community some facility, but separate as in two distinct schools with their own culture. Two schools, one place that we are going to call home. Rua Paroa, in the old Māori term, um, a place where the east wind blows from the sea, that's where we are looking forward to, um, to um, establishing our new home. When do we think that's going to happen? Well, folk, it seems to me that um, all things being equal, we will know the consortium that's going to build us within the next few months. We will be sorting out the final stages of the arrangement with the Council and with Avonside and ourselves by the end of this year and it's our expectation that the first piece of the ground will be turned over around about April, May of 2017. 18 months to rebuild and we walk in fresh, ready for the new chapter in our history at the start of 2019. We invite everybody to come and join us, be part of our journey, um, and at the end of it, what will benefit? Eastern part of Christchurch, two very much established schools in the city, and all the people who want to be part of that wonderful new future. Thanks for listening.